Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Jadine and I hope you guys consider subscribing. So today is a day where I am home. You know, I'm just home and I'm home and that's that. So, one of my friends asked me to do something for her and initially it came as like a favor and it was no issue or anything and then now I just feel like sis is straight up using me, okay? At first, she was sick when she asked me to do it. And I'm just like, yeah, okay, great. Not an issue. I will go out of my way to do it, which I didn't have to because I asked to be dropped there. But now I just feel like last night I was leaving and she was just like, um, yeah, remember you have to collect the thing for me. And I'm like, collect the thing? What thing? And she was just like, yeah, the money to drop up. Okay, so this is now a chore? First of all, I did not sign up for this. And I feel like I don't have an issue doing things for people as long as it doesn't take me out of my way. Today I'm home, inside not going anywhere and you're asking me to go do something for you that requires me to leave when i'm not leaving here for myself and you drive now i feel like you're straight up using me and i don't think i like that i love friends and i feel like friendships are healthy and everything but i don't i don't know i don't feel like i like that i feel like now it's beginning to rub me the wrong way last week too she asked me to do something for her uh, I was home and I wasn't doing anything else and I'm just like, yeah, it's not going to take me that long if I multitask to do it for her. And I did and I did it for her. And then she wanted me to straight up do every single step of the way for her when I used my whole ass day to sit here and create the profile for her and everything. She wanted me to just do everything. So sis, what do you want to do for yourself? And I just feel like... have to be able to invest in yourself too whether it be your time or money or whatever I did the core for you invest some of your time into it now because it's primarily for you today she called me and she's like I'm gonna call you back and have you do um okay and have me do first of all you're having me do something right now that I don't even want to do and last night when I was leaving I was just like listen I'm telling you that even Saturday I'm still gonna have this money because I'm not leaving tomorrow and I don't feel like I should force myself to go out in the cold. Goddamn Wendy, my hair is in two braids. The hat is about to blow off because it's too windy outside for this right now. And I'm just like, um, I don't, I don't know. And then I felt like last night she kind of played me too. Because she was just like, oh, so the money is short of $60. And I'm just like, so she's like, I'm going to sell it to you. First of all, you're already giving me this to do where I'm going to go out of my way to go drop it off. And now you're sending me more out of my way to go to an ATM to draw your money and then still go out of my way to drop it off. Like you're, you're really asking too much of me. And I feel like for this new year, I'm not entertaining all that. You know, I don't see what you're doing for me as a friend. Not that I'm asking much. And I feel like I'm that person too who I don't really ask much of people, but I just feel like... You also have to be considerate because when you're asking somebody to do you a favor, you can't be asking them to do you a favor and then to still do so many other stuff too on top of doing you the favor. And that is really irritating me. And I feel like when I bottle these things up and it gets to a point where I actually do say something, it never comes out good. Because when I'm ready to say something, you can tell that I'm frustrated. And I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, after three goddamn minutes of doing all that, I just seasoned up some meat that I'm going to cook today. But right now, I'm gonna run to the coffee shop because I feel like I need some coffee. This morning, I put my coffee and everything inside of the cup to make, you know, my morning. And I just did not because I feel like I wasn't really... I wasn't really in that mood anymore. I didn't want that coffee anymore. And I was so upset with my body too because I was expecting that I'd wake up at like 11 or 12 and I woke up at 8.30 and I was mad as hell. Anyways, I'm about to put my jacket on and run outside really quickly and come back. Thought I was going to go outside right at that minute, but I'm going to wait a little bit first. First, it's still super windy outside. I feel like I'm kind of annoyed too. I'm going to cook today. I think I need to go to the grocery store, which I was not trying to do right now. But I think I'm for the last couple of weeks, I've been eating sweet potato. But the last couple of days, I've just been, I don't know. I ate two burgers, two consecutive days, and I just feel like, oh, ew. And I've been trying to do this workout thing. I'm telling you, when you're trying to be great, 
everything just starts attacking you. I feel like I'm also so annoyed because my husband and I, we don't talk right now and his job is to take the trash out. We don't put the trash out with like the regular trash because at his job, he could just bring everything all together. And you know, in New York, you have to kind of separate it, like the bottles and the this and the that. So he normally just takes it to his job and like throw it away. So we don't talk, like we really don't talk. And he he saw that I, I, I put the garbage like right at the front door. So when he's leaving, he'll remember it. And he just been leaving it there for days because we don't talk. And I just feel like that is so but whatever <laughs> i feel like i always there's always so much that i filter out and but i think it's so funny the lengths he's going to right now to be petty like son it's the trash <laughs> are you kidding me <laughs> oh god <laughs> This is so ridiculous. So, the, and there were two um, big, oh, I did my nails too. So cute. There were two big cardboard boxes there too. And I just went in and like cut them up into like tiny pieces and put them inside of the big bag too. And just tied the bag so it looked more presentable right at the entryway, like right at the front door. Like every time I come inside of here, I'm so annoyed because big ass bag is just sitting there in the way and I'm just like as much as I want to be petty I don't do little things like this I just feel like it's so annoying to be petty too like you're gonna put all that energy into doing what I don't know I feel like I'm such a different species honestly <laughs> but we're here obviously I have a lot to say today so I did my nails and Washed my hair last night and I'm going to blow it out because I think this week I'm going to straighten it. It's been four months since the last time that I straightened my hair. So I feel like um, I'm not going to be damaging it if I, you know, do a little straightening here and there right now to look cute or whatever. Because I feel like I'm tired of putting it up in a bun. Even though I feel like I'm going to straighten it just to put it back up in a bun. But, you know, it's going to be easier because it's... Silky straight. These are the moments where I feel like I consider relaxing my hair because I remember how easy it was to deal with my hair when it was relaxed because it wasn't as puffy as it is now that it's natural, you know? Because it's natural. And this is exactly why I always just style my hair from straight instead of the shower. Like if I'm going to do a low puff, I put it in the low puff straight after I wash it or whatever I'm going to do, I put it in that style from then because it's so much easier to handle my hair when it's wet. And in the winter time, I can't just be going around spraying up my hair in the mornings with water and whatnot because it's cold outside and Sister Numona is just sitting around the corner and we're not trying to get her. So... Oh, this hair thing is just so annoying and I like to when I wear the wigs consistently for like a month I give it a break and like you know let my hair breathe and stuff which is what I'm doing right now But I have to find things that I can do with my hair in the moments where I'm letting it breathe which is when I feel like I'm the most annoyed because I don't know what to do and I'm gonna put your hair up in one type of girl Anyways I'm really gonna put my jacket on right now and like leave. Gotta go run those errands and I have to go draw that money for good sis. And I feel like this week I'm gonna tell her that, listen, this is the last week I'm doing it because I feel like you're not making much of an effort to do most of the work. The only thing I want you to give me to do is to drop it off. And I want you to give it to me to drop it off when I'm being picked up. If I gotta go take the bus, obviously it's taking me out of my way to go drop it off. And it's cold as fuck outside because it's winter. And honestly, I'm not trying to go out of my way. I feel like I say all this right now, and when I'm standing in front of people, most of the things that I want to say, I don't get it out. Because I feel like I'm not a confrontational person, and I just cannot be bothered with what it's going to go into. You explaining to me why you didn't draw it, and I don't care about that. I just want you to draw it and give it to me, or not give it to me at all, and go drop it off since you drive. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go. Hi guys, so it's much, much much later i just came back off of the road so, well i was talking to my sister for a little bit and then i came in had a nice little coffee a dunkin donut and was just chilling for a hot little minute i was talking to my sister a little bit just now went and dropped off the people's money and shit but now i'm really just relaxing with my nails done and everything love that i bought two face masks the other day that I think I want to do this one is detoxifying I don't think 
for my face. Let me put y'all down here. Right now it's 5.33. I don't think for my face I need a detoxifying mask because I feel like my skin is pretty decent. So I bought the detoxifying one and I bought this anti-aging one. So I feel like I'm personally going to use this anti-aging one for myself and then the detoxifying one. I'm going to leave it until... Maybe one day I feel like my face needs a little bit of detoxifying and I have some wine on there that I was drinking a little bit earlier, but yep, yeah, that is what's up. I'm about to take this hat off and I'm going to look crazy because <laughs> my hair inside of this freshly washed braids, it's, it's not really it. It's not cute. Okay. So, yeah. Wow, it's a little bit cool inside here. What I'm saying is it's cold. But right now I'm going to cook. Oh, ow. The chicken that I had seasoned earlier and put in the refrigerator. So I need to lock the bedroom doors because this vent that's supposed to be underneath the microwave that like sucks the food sent out and brings it outside that one is not working but i'm about to curry this chicken dumb quick and um yeah i also think this is where i'm gonna end this vlog because i vlogged earlier today it wasn't much but i still did so thank you guys for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog even though it was a little bit short and i will see you guys in the next vlog make sure you guys subscribe share it with a friend and um, yeah, give the video a thumb up. And I'll see you guys in my next video.